Tears of the Kingdom's Ganondorf looks amazing. It's been a whopping 17 years since we last saw Ganondorf in Twilight Princess, my personal favorite Zelda game. He looked really cool there, but with voice acting, a new art style, and a new story, Ganondorf looks best in Tears of the Kingdom. It's been confirmed that Matt Mercer is the voice behind Ganondorf, which is pretty cool since he's a pretty accomplished voice actor. Also in this shot, it shows what it looks like to be Demise, and we know it isn't Ganondorf because the hair looks completely different. So if we could get Ganondorf and Demise, that would be a really big upgrade to Breath of the Wild's final bosses. Also, one thing I've noticed while watching the trailer over and over again is about that shot of Ganondorf sending Malice to the sky. What I find so interesting about this is that the Malice stops at what seems to be a barrier. And before Skyward Sword, the Goddess Hylia made a barrier from the sky to the surface so that Demise wouldn't be able to hurt anyone in the sky. And this shot could be Ganondorf breaking that barrier, which is probably where the Sky Islands came from in the first place. This shows how powerful and menacing Tears of the Kingdom's Ganondorf may be. And all this makes me more excited to play Tears of the Kingdom. And if you don't want to miss any of my videos about it, then go ahead and subscribe. Anyways, that's all I have to say. Goodbye.